More than a year ago, I was diagnosed with a blood cancer called multiple myeloma. It's been difficult, to say the least. But I never imagined one of the worst parts would be worrying about whether I could pay for my treatment. I went to the pharmacy and learned that even with my Medicare coverage, my first prescription fill would cost me thousands of dollars. And that's just the first month. It turns out Medicare has no limit to what patients like me have to pay for their treatment. And I'll be taking this drug for the rest of my life. My family and I shouldn't have to choose between paying for treatment and paying for things like my rent and groceries. I'm not alone in this struggle. Each year, four out of 10 cancer patients with Medicare Part D will abandon their treatment at the pharmacy counter when it costs over $2,000. But there is a way to stop these limitless costs. Congress should establish an out-of-pocket cap, dramatically reducing what seniors pay for treatment. And if Congress does it right and smooths out high upfront costs over the course of the year, then patients like me won't be forced to pay thousands at the pharmacy counter. Democrats and Republicans both think it's a good idea, but we need them to finally make it happen. Learn what you can do to help people like me who wake up with the same question each morning. Can I afford my cancer treatment today?